Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to find what files and what types of files are taking up space on your hard drive in Windows. Uh, this will work for Windows 10 and Windows 11, the same procedure. So you could do this using the Windows tools and you don't have to worry about downloading any third-party applications or installing anything. So I have this Windows 10 computer here, two hard drives, a flash drive, DVD drive, that kind of thing. So I have my Windows drive and the data drive, which is getting full here, so I want to kind of see what's taking up the space because if I just click on the files, it's just going to show the folders and it's not going to really help me out without having to browse things and, you know, right-click, check the properties and so on. So you could go to the Windows settings under System and then to Storage. And then you'll have all these uh, categories here for types of files that are on your computer. And if you don't have them shown like this, you could just click on Show More Categories and you could see, you know, pictures and documents and you could see... I don't have any pictures on the C drive and so on. But what I want to look at is the D drive. So I want to find the uh, view storage usage on other drives. And then pick this drive. And then you can see I have 800 gigs in videos, 97 in music, and I have my documents on here, and that kind of thing. And if I click on other, this is what I want to go to to really break things down. Unless you're concerned more about video files. But I want to find the stuff that I don't know about. So click on other. You see I have these uh, virtual machines that are taking up all kinds of space on the drive and ISO files and then some uh, Premiere Elements files. So like these files here, these are just temporary video files from Adobe Premiere, the video editor. So if I click on it, then it opens it up right there and then I could, you know, delete all these and get 12 gigs back. So obviously you need to know if it's safe to delete these files before you uh, do it. And then you can kind of scroll down and just get an idea of all the stuff on there and clean it up as necessary. And another thing you can do too is check for temporary files. So in this case on the D drive, the only temporary files that I have are the recycle bin. And I could delete those from here if I want. But if I go back to the C drive and go to temporary files, then it'll show me that I have stuff, you know, from like Windows updates and uh, temporary internet files and that kind of thing, which I could actually go through and delete as well. So once again, just from your uh, system and storage, and then if you have more than one drive, you could uh, view the storage on that one, and then you could go by category, or if you want to pick uh, other to really kind of get to the stuff that you might not know about, you could do so. And then same, I got Windows 11 computer here, storage, and you can see the C drive here is almost full, and I could click on other you know, to see what kind of stuff is going on here. And I could clean up the uh, temporary files needed, but it's only 20 megabytes, so or 67 megabytes, so I might as well just clean those up and at least get that space back. Then I could worry about, the, you know, figuring out what else is going on there. All right, so uh, check that out in your Windows settings and uh, get your stuff cleaned up. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. <laughs>